Uh, Malcolm, you okay after uh, the deep ball that got, that got away? Yeah, I'm all right. That was. You talking about the one on the sideline, the one right here? The, the one, one where you almost hit us. Oh, I mean, if a rope take me out, I'm not supposed to be in the league. So. <laughs> <laughs> Malcolm, we just spoke with Phil. I know he went through quite a transition to your position this year. How do you feel he's come along in developing as a pass catcher and as a tight end? Uh, when we first happened, we thought it was a joke, but then we was like, okay, you're really in here. So we um, we just brought him under our wing and everything that I was working on, I would teach him if I saw him doing something wrong. I wasn't a hating guy and nothing like that. Just because another guy came in the room, I mean, I, I want to compete and I want my room to be the best room possible. So I had to make sure that he was okay. Can you talk about your journey a little bit? I mean, you, you went from Texas to USC, and now you're at a pro day in Pittsburgh. I mean, you know, how did you get to this point? Uh, first and foremost, God, without him, I wouldn't be nowhere. Without, I wouldn't be nowhere. Um, but just trusting myself, betting on myself, and talking to people and believing in myself was what got me here. So shout out to my mom for um, helping me graduate early from college. So that way I could have, I could be a grad transfer anywhere I went. Uh, important thing about my household was making sure you leave college with something. So that's, that's why we went the long route. We went the six-year route, got two degrees, and therefore after football, God willing, I go to the league, I have a plan to fall back on. But not being invited to the combine, does that motivate you? Yeah, of course it motivates me. Of course everybody wants to go to the pro, to the combine, but at the end of the day, it's all about strapping up pads and winning your one-on-one. -on -one. With, today, with today's world of football, there's so many leagues now that are available. Are you a guy that's like NFL or bust, or are you willing to consider, like if you don't get a crack at the NFL right away, Work in other places to get to get to get a shot at the NFL. I would be lying and say I wouldn't. I'm not NFL or bust, but that's what it was for me. That is that's what it is for me. But if not, and God willing, I have somewhere else to go. I, like you said, there's a lot of leagues to play in, so I can always work my way back to the NFL. Mm -hmm. You were a teammate of Bubs for the past year. W what makes him like such a great prospect? I mean, what stands out to you about Bub Means? Dude is a freak. He <laughs> eat a bag of hot chips and a sweet tea before practice and go crazy. I don't. I don't get it. I, don't, I can't. I wish I had like his. I don't know what he has. I wish I had that. I guess he's from Georgia. It's probably what it is. But he, he's a he's a he's a specimen, man. But before that, he's a great guy. He's a, as soon as I came in, I was the first guy I got cool with, talked to, helped me get to my apartment and stuff like that. That's my brother for life, honestly. Like if we we couldn't be no close, I'd have met his mom, he'd have met mine. Yeah, blood couldn't make us close. What did you, you didn't try hot chips then? <laughs> I, the hot food messed my stomach up. I can't do that. <laughs> what do you think you showed today? that I'm an elite pass catcher. And I can run routes from my side at 260, 6'5", 6'6". Six, six. That's what I showed, a vertical threat down the field, a red zone threat for sure. So, and I can run a little bit, so. What, what kind of NFL, what NFL teams have you, have you got a chance to speak with so far? Uh, I talk with the Texans, I talk with the Bills, and then uh, while I was out there, I talked with the Jets for a little bit. Anything else for Mal? I had a Christian throw, I just like Christian throw the team today. CV, that's another one of my, that's one, another one of my dudes. Uh, we were crazy now. Everything we went over, we went over like Monday. And he did a great job. I mean, of course, he missed a couple throws, but nobody's perfect. So and then we, I missed catcher too. So. But for CV to do that and come out and show out, I really appreciate him. Okay.